it. The, uh, as always, there's a, there's a lot of buzz about AV over IP at shows. And this year, whilst picture quality is still important, the, the, the topical conversations are about bandwidth. Is it time to look at the 10 gig solutions or can my client still use his, uh, his one gig legacy networks? That's important, it affects all of the AV over IP disciplines. And on the Matrox booth behind me, we've got KVM extenders, we've got wall control solutions, multi-viewers, streaming encoders, all, all AV over IP, and they're all affected by bandwidth. Well, running out of bandwidth is bad for AV over IP. So what, what is it they're all talking about? Well, we all recognize the scenario of the network's a bit slow today. And that's generally because something in the network has run out of bandwidth. And it could be as simple as the switch that's nearest to you. Because just because it's a one gig network and you've got a, an RJ45 in front of you doesn't mean you've automatically got one gig up and down at your network port. The, uh, the switches could well be the problem that have run out of the, the bandwidth. So why do they run out of bandwidth? Well, we all know about the headline bandwidth, the one gig or the 10 gig, and this, uh, this scenario affects all of, the, all of the different networks. There's two other bandwidths we need to think about. There's the fabric bandwidth between the ports on a switch, and there's the link bandwidth, where one port on one switch is talking to a port on another switch. And that isn't as big as you think it is. So if you've got a 12, uh, 12 port, one gig switch, you haven't got 12 gigs up and 12 gigs down, that'd be 24. It's quite likely you've got eight or four gigs, and that's what you run out of. How does this affect AV over IP? Well, the high bandwidth intensive, intensive ones, like JPEG 2000 on a one gig, like SDV over E on a 10 gig, they're great for a few streams on their network, but if you've got multiples of them, a multi-user environment, you start to stress that link bandwidth. When you run out of it, bad for AV over IP. So, what's the way around it? You use streams that don't fill the network. So, if you put in multiple 800 meg streams, you might think it's less than a gig, you can still overload the switch. But if you can put in 100 meg streams instead of 800 meg streams, much less chance of overloading it, and that's where H.264 comes in because you can move 4K60 at 444 quality if you want to, multiples of them if you want to, and still not overload your one gig network. Seeing is believing. Talk to Matrox, that's the place to see it.